glass too. Uh, we have some non-strengthened soda lime glass, and these glasses uh, here we have soda, non-strengthened soda lime, strengthened soda lime, Gorilla Glass, and Gorilla Glass Two. They've all been abraded with silicon carbide, which is basically sandpaper grit, sandpaper particles. And on all these samples, you'll see a, a hazy region, which is where the damage has been put into the glass. And what we're going to do is put these samples into the tester and show you the pounds required either to break it or show you what it's capable of withstanding without breaking. So we'll start out with uh, kind of a generic glass, a non-strengthened soda lime glass. We'll go ahead and we load this into the tester. And we'll bring down the, uh, the test head and you can see the breaking load at around 44 pounds. Next we'll take the same type of glass but we'll run it through a chemical strengthening process. This is similar to the process that Gorilla Glass would go through. And we can see here, go ahead and reset this guy. Bring this down. Bad, we got about a 40%, 20% kind of a benefit here. It varies depending on the sample. Um, 59, 60 pounds, that's not bad. Now let's take a look at Corning Gorilla Glass, which is the current product in the marketplace today. I should have mentioned these are all one millimeter in thickness. Okay. Go ahead and load this sample up, and I'm going to have to kind of get in here. I need to get some, some weight on it. We'll load this up. Over 80, 90, 100, 123. This is the current product in the market today, right? So we want this level of performance. We want to make the glass 20% thinner, and that's Corning Gorilla Glass 2. Enables products to be made thinner. So we have 0.8 millimeter Gorilla Glass, same abrasion process. Go ahead and load this in the tester. Go ahead and bring this down. Get out of your way here, we load this up. 22. So, same level of performance, but 20% thinner. So. And then there's other benefits associated with going thinner. You get less weight. Uh, you also have the benefit of some brighter images because you have better optical transmission, as well as greater touch sensitivity with a thinner glass. So. Uh, it mentions that it has brighter images. Yes. Uh, how does that work? So we actually, our glass composition delivers better optical transmission, okay. as well as when you go thinner, you gain a benefit as well because you have less glass in the optical path. Okay. Yep. Uh, what type of glass do you support? I mean, what type of touch panels do you support at the moment? Uh, we can work with any any touch panel. Any other? Yes. Oh, okay. Yep. How close are we seeing uh, uh, phones or tablets with this built in? How close? Oh, with this product? Yeah, with, with Corning Glass 2. Uh, we have several customers that have disclosed their intent to work with Corning Gorilla Glass 2 and put it in their, into their devices. We don't have any timelines right now for specific products, though. Okay. Yep. Uh, 